Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Dave's Garage. And we got this Vitamix sent to us to try out, and I'm happy to say that, that I'm very pleased with it. Now today, we'll be cooking with Dave's Garage because the wife's out of town. So the good folks at Dave's Garage still have to eat, and uh, the wife was good enough to chop us up some nice vegetables before she left. But you know, I'm just really not that good at cooking. So I'm gonna use this Vitamixer to make my breakfast, and I'm gonna show you how I do it. So we're gonna make a nice, healthy, vegetarian breakfast in about, oh, a minute. So check it out. So first ingredient, we got a little bit of celery. We're gonna throw that in there. And our second ingredient, <laughs> we, we got a bunch of leftover broccoli. So we're gonna throw that in there too. And we also have some, some nice uh, bell peppers. Um, can't really do a whole lot of these. Probably could make fajitas, but uh, it's a little bit out of my wheelhouse. So. We're gonna throw those in the Vitamix as well. Now this right here, we had uh, one orange left, so we're gonna throw this one whole peeled orange in here. And I personally love spinach. I'm not a kale guy, but I'll eat spinach all day. So we got a few, a uh, little bit of leftover organic spinach. We're gonna throw that in there. Let's get all that goodness in there. Ooh, looks so good. And we've got I'm not exactly sure what these are. I would call them green beans or maybe snap peas. I don't know, but we don't have time to cook them. So we're gonna throw these suckers in there too. So we'll give a handful of those. We'll save a little for later. And we're gonna do, I think this is cilantro. So we'll get some more greens in there in our Vitamix. And uh, we'll put a little bit of lemon in there just for some added flavor. Give a little bit of added bonus, you know, here at Dave's Garage, we are all about added bonuses, whether we're working on cars or cooking our meals. So we'll put a lemon in there for a little bit. And then we got a lime too. So we'll go ahead and throw a lime in there. We're out of, uh, out of Coronas. So we're going to repurpose these today in a Vitamix. Oh, I'm get all that in there. All right. Now, we're gonna throw a little bit of kombucha in there. I love kombucha. If you don't know what kombucha is, it's a probiotic. Uh, you can check it out in your grocery store. Um, it's really, really good stuff, good for your gut. So throw a little kombucha in there for some probiotics. And then we're gonna fill this sucker up to about 40 ounces of water. Okay, we've got our 40 ounces of water. We're gonna do a little bit of some protein powder in here, just for the muscles. Do one scoop, we'll go two scoops. Now we're ready to blend. Now this sucker here is super, super powerful. You can throw just about anything in here and it'll cut it up. So in the immortal words of Dr. Emmett Brown from Back to the Future, when this sucker hits 88 miles per hour, you're gonna see some serious shit. <laughs> Stay tuned. All right, we're gonna check out our concoction, see how it tastes. Looks good, it smells earthy. pretty good. Mm. So that's actually delicious. You're probably a little grossed out with the, some of the products I threw in there, but it actually is really, really good. So thank you to Vitamix for sending us the blender. Thanks to our corporate sponsorship for paying for it. And here's to your health, your wealth, and your happiness. If you like our product reviews or some of our work out in the garage, please like and subscribe to the channel and we'll send you a little notification anytime we do a little video like this. Have a great day.